I've got some exciting military space news. And no, I'm sorry to say the new NDAA does not include the addition of a space shuttle door gunner MOS. Scientists from the U.S. Naval Research Laboratory, as well as other collaborating institutions, have confirmed the first known case of radio-emitting active galactic nuclei within a single ongoing galaxy merger. This is according to an article by Jameson Crabtree. Scientists use the Carl G. Jansky Very Large Array at the National Radio Astronomy Observatory and the Very Long Baseline Array, which consists of 10 radio telescopes across the United States and the Virgin Islands, to study the cores of three galaxies that are in the process of merging together. But what does any of this mean and why do we care? Well, the discovery provides new evidence of how supermassive black holes grow and interact when galaxies collide and merge together, which is one of the key processes to understanding the evolution of our universe. According to Dr. Emma Schwartzman, an astrophysicist and fellow at the Naval Research Laboratory, it's believed that larger galaxies in our universe were created through the merger of smaller galaxies, and this research is giving us a very rare glimpse into that process. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. There's a lot in this article, and I'm not sure if I can adequately explain it all, as I am most definitely more qualified to be a shuttle door gunner than I am an astrophysicist. So I'll make sure to post the link to the article in my socials so you can read it yourself, or if one of the many amazing science creators on this app wants to stitch this video to give a better explanation of the importance of this discovery, that would be incredible. But as always, please make sure to like and share to spread the word, and don't forget to follow for more military news you probably didn't know.